The objective of this activity is to locate the altitudes of a triangle and to verify that these altitudes pass through the same point. Let's understand the concept of an altitude first. Suppose you draw any triangle like this triangle and name it as A, B, C. If you draw a perpendicular from the vertex A on the side BC like this, that means this line AD is perpendicular to the side BC of the triangle, then this perpendicular AD is known as the altitude. So, how many altitudes can we draw in a triangle? I have used the vertex A to draw the altitude AD. You can draw another altitude from vertex B like this, where the altitude BE will be perpendicular to the side AC, and so BE is also the altitude. Likewise, from C, I can draw another altitude like this, making an angle of 90 degree with AB. So CF is perpendicular to AB. So I can draw three different altitudes which I have put in circles here AD, BE and CF and surprisingly these three altitudes when drawn correctly will pass through the same point. This point O where the three altitudes meet is known as the point of concurrence of the three altitudes. The material required to perform this activity include a white chart paper, colored, uh, you know, or we require the complete set of sketch pins, then the geometry box and a pair of scissors for cutting work and fabricol for pasting work. Let's perform this activity of altitudes now. To understand what is the altitude of a triangle and that the three altitudes of a triangle are concurrent, that means they pass through the same point, you have to take a cutout of any kind of triangle. It can be a scalene triangle or an equilateral triangle, an isosceles triangle, a right angle triangle, whatever. So any random triangle is to be cut out from a sheet of paper. And now we need to draw a line from any one of the vertex, vertex like I'm taking this vertex and drawing a line like this. And the condition is that this line should make an angle of 90 degree with the opposite side. So you can see here this angle here is looking more like a, a 90 degree angle. So this line which we have drawn is known as the altitude of a triangle. Can we draw one more altitude from this vertex now? Obviously yes we can. So let's place the scale like this and draw yet another altitude and mind you this has to make an angle of 90 degree with the opposite side only then it will be called an altitude and what if we rotate it one more time like this to make one more altitude yes we can here we go this is the third altitude so this is more like 90 degree angle now so i'm drawing it here like this and see this also makes an angle of 90 degree with the opposite side and surprisingly what happens is the three altitudes they are passing through the same point and so it is the property of a triangle that whenever you draw three altitudes they always pass through the same point or they are called concurrent. So what is an altitude? An altitude is a line drawn from a vertex of a triangle so that it forms an angle of 90 degree with the opposite side. There are three altitudes in a triangle and all the three altitudes are concurrent. That means they pass through the same point as we have verified through this activity.